What you see is a very clear pattern on the screen. You see sort of stripes, a stripe on the screen where you get lots of electrons, and then a stripe where you get very few or none, and then another stripe where you get lots, and then a stripe where you get very few or none, and then another stripe and then very few or none. So you get this stripey pattern. That pattern is exactly the same pattern that you would get if you sent waves through the slit. The fact that you get it from particles is interesting. But here's another interesting thing. You still get that pattern if you send one particle at a time through the slit. But many physicists would say, no, it does. So the statement is that the electron explores both routes at the same time, at once, let's say, on its route from the electron gun through the slits to the screen. We surely think of particles as following definite paths. And it might be that you don't know quite which path it's going to take, but surely you would say, it, in reality, <laughs> it will go one route or the other route. But that experiment, which I emphasize has been done now many times, tells us that nature is not like that.